I did sleep, yeah. Um, I watched a kind of a, a G me up movie. Okay. And, uh, <laughs> Do you remember what it was? Yeah, I can't, I, any given Sunday. That was oh, the one. Oh, there you go. Yeah, oh, 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 sorry, I do it. I yeah. watched it, I remember, yeah, I remember vividly. Uh, five o'clock in the evening, watched it, and uh, went to bed, watched a bit of Sunday game. Not too much in case something hits my head. Yeah. And I uh, got up, and uh, sometimes the first start arguing is actually easier because you're a lot younger. You don't really see the enormity of the, of the game, the situation, right. and you kind of show off the shackles and go for it. When you're older, you think a little bit more about certain things. Yeah. yeah. Because you had so much pressure on you anyway as the years went on because a hugely successful Kilkenny team. All stars coming out during you know what and all Ireland yeah. medals and Leinster medals and everything else. And the, but as it what went on, did you feel a lot of pressure personally on on yourself? The pre the pressure to perform and outperform. Um, there's always pressure there, no matter what game you're playing, especially in our Ireland players. There's always pressure there. But I think as a team, you kind of soak it up and you can actually flip it on its head and use it kind of as ammunition to go into the next game. Like mm. I'm sure Limerick over the last couple of years, kind of bought into more team environment rather than saying the outside because when you're winning. Everyone wants it shot down, you know, when you're not winning, yeah. you know, after a year or two, everyone wants you to win. So it's just kind of shot. Very few people have experienced the elation of scoring an All-Ireland final goal, but you have. What's that moment like? Like, does the adrenaline not take over? I can only imagine the shape you <laughs> to get into the box like. It's so hard to control. You yeah. just want to go crazy. Um, but you have to, as I said, it's a, it's a nervous energy. And when you score the goal, you just want to go crazy. Like it, and that's the matter. But you have to get back into your position. There's another 50, 60 yeah. minutes to be played. Yeah. That's yeah. what's crazy. Yeah. But uh, 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 after the game is over, them 10 minutes, lads, it's, it's, if you could bottle that, can I best feel it? Okay, can yeah. I just ask? Right, we need to know something very important here, Martin. What? Who's, who do you think is going to win it? Ooh. I'm going to give my tip of the hat to Cork. Um, <laughs> I think they are in the wrong. What do you think, guys? Do you think? Watch this. Cork. 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 This is going on one of these. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm only missing. Don't worry. Martin wants to wear that himself. Yeah. I won't put it no, on you. No. You no. point blank refused. Yeah, yeah, no, but, but deep down, as a Kilkenny man, four in a row winner. You kind of glad Limerick can't go for five. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if we say it on live television, Martin, but uh, no, it's a small, it's, it's human nature. Look, yeah. you, you want to be the best, you want to still be classed as one of the top teams, yeah, yeah. I think. So, look, Limerick have been exceptional champions, and they are one of the best teams I've ever seen so far. And they will go down in history as one of the greatest teams. Mm. Um, for history wise, you don't see history being made. Yeah. Maybe by a Kenny team. We did you a favour, basically. Yeah, basically. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. enough talking.